Hi everyone. We are going to present you some crucial automation tool with this video series fully based on Node.js. Today basically our task is scraping some details by query URL. Actually you can watch, the same task is done by Python is available in Python tool video series and its link is mentioned in the description below. Here what our task for today is scraping market data values for an any symbol. We are using Yahoo Finance website. You can find that here we can see charts with some stats and currency price. If we observe the chart thoroughly, that can be noticed that this is SGD currency price chart with 1D time interval relative to the US dollars. Here you can see some stats of SGD with the Tamis stamp. So there are open price, close price, high price and low price. We are going to grab these price stats with the time stamp in this task. I think, if I will give brief introduction to this price fields, that can be clearly understood with candlesticks. Here we can change the graph into candlestick. So then some of you may know that open price is starting price of the candle, closing price is ending price of the candle. Low price is the lowest price of the candle, and high is the highest price of the candle. In this finance Yahoo site, we can get the whole JSON which carries these values. You need to inspect its element like this. When we refresh the page we will have large number of number web requests from this site. You can check the response of each request. We know response should be the JSON. From those hints we can find the exact web request. This is the correct response. You can see the values that we require. This will be the URL that can be used to scrap data. We can query this URL with our browser too. With the browser we can check its structure. This will be very easy for our coding session. Here we go for coding. This is my JavaScript file which is going to be run by Node.js. First you need to import npm modules to here that we are using. Here we import request module and we can use in build method require. This is our URL which is copied by Yahoo Finance. Let's parameterize the symbol to insert from a command line argument.
Now we need to call the rest and get the payload with data by request module. This is the code block for getting the response in a synchronous way. Now we call separate method to extract data. We will see how our method is. This is the final method. You need to refer the JSON structure well to write this code block. Here we push an object to the array in each to stamp with open price, close price, low price and high price. Finally we log this array. The better way for logging an array in JavaScript is console.table. You need to run npm install firstly to import required modules. Now we need to run the code with node file name and symbol. Oh ho, what's this error? My god, I am sorry, JSON should be defined with colon no. Here we got the result with a table. Special thing is there to mention that you can parameterize starting date, ending date to define the time period for data. And those parameters can be loaded from another configuration file. We are done for today. If you get some knowledge with this and you need to know about more automation tools, you can subscribe to this channel and continue the journey with us. Thank you.